Gamers on Games is sponsored in part by... I'm Lynn from Metalhead Minis. Great to meet you. Uh, be sure to check us out online at metalheadminis.com. You can find out more about our services, such as miniature painting. We also do consignment. We also teach at local game stores. Be sure to check us out at metalheadminis.com. Thanks for having me. Hi, this is Dennis with 3D Game Gear. We are gamers with a family-run business that specialize in 3D printed accessories for board games. We offer a wide range of items, including tokens, token cups, token boxes, player dashboards, and much more. We are always adding new items to enhance your gaming experience, so come check us out at the address below. And by viewers like you. Hey guys, it's Steve for Gamers on Games, and welcome back for another unboxing video. And this is going to be for a custom figure for Dust 1947, featuring the oh so coveted bear. Yes, this is a bear figure custom made and given to us by Game Chefs uh, Jeff, and is uh, was designed by uh, Dewey Cat for use in. Dust 1947. There's the great debate of bears for the SSU, and this was given to me as a result of the great debate. So we're going to open this up. And there it is. It's a uh, 3D print of a bear carrying a shell. You can see right there. Right there. Right there. It's beautiful. So, bear with shell for SSU. Now, what this is, is this is uh, modeled over the concept of uh, Voidtech. Uh, also uh, uh, spelt with a W O J T E K, and uh, this was a real this was a real thing. This is a real thing that actually happened during the war. Uh, Voitech was a uh, Syrian brown bear, and was actually made a corporal so that they could uh, justify feeding it, and it moved ammo crates around uh, for. Uh, for the Polish and uh, it wound up surviving the war and lived out the rest of its life in uh, Edinburgh Zoo in Scotland and because I, I knew this was coming uh, I actually decided to uh, stat this sucker out so uh, what Wojtek is is and I'm gonna put the the stat line down in the uh, the video description so you guys can copy and use it and contact uh, game chefs and maybe get your own and what it is is uh, it's got a march of three it's got a forced march of five uh, it costs eight points to field counts as infantry two and has six hits because I'm making it a hero uh, Voitek is damage resilient berserk has charge and uh, a new thing I call reloader and I'll get to what that means in a moment uh, its only weapon is a pair of claws. Uh, it does 2-1 for uh, infantry classes 1 and 2. And then for infantry 3-4, it does 1-1. One, one. So, one die and one hit. But because it's got Berserk, that should mitigate. Uh, Reloader, what that does is as long as it does not attack itself, um, so no, no melee attacks, uh, it can reload everybody in the squad. So if you want to put this one with uh, an artillery squad or you want to put it with a uh, infantry squad that's got under barrel grenade launchers, it just automatically loads everybody in the squad. Uh, no roll, it's just an action and everybody's back up to full ammunition, which is great. So if you want to start just chucking grenades everywhere, uh, this is going to be a good way to get that done. So, 
that is Voitech, and I hope that you guys enjoyed this. Uh, bears for the SSU. That's all I gotta say. Hope you guys enjoyed this. We'll catch you later. Dave, out. Just a reminder that everything you see here on Gamers on Games is made possible by patrons like you. Why not check out our Patreon page? It would really help us out.